Kenton County school officials are rolling the dice on a stock market investment simulation designed to make students better at math. Down one. Woodland and Turkeyfoot Middle School students recently traveled to community partner Fidelity Investments to compete in a stock market-based investment tournament designed to sharpen their math skills. Students know that this is what the, these people do for a living and that they're experts at this and the fact that they are taking time out of their day to come into our schools and now to bring us into their building and treat these kids wonderfully, it's just been really exciting, so it's been a great partnership. It's a core value at Fidelity to be engaged in the community. Thousands of hours a year giving back, and it's a national directive that we are involved in education. So this program fits perfectly, and Kenton County is obviously a fantastic partner. The financially based program was embedded into the district's seventh grade math curriculum this year. Students in the class learn real life math concepts like percentages using high tech hands on tools such as an investment simulation game, an online investment challenge, and today's simulated stock investment tournament. District leaders set up the reality based partnership with NKU, Ninth Wave, the Edwards Foundation, Omniology, and Fidelity Investments. The mission is to show kids the importance of math in possible future careers. I think it not only gives validity to the program, but I think it also shows students that there really are authentic reasons that they need to explore and learn math at a deep level. For a long time we've heard kids say, why do I have to learn this stuff? I think they're finding that there's a good reason to learn this, and in the end we hope to monitor that trend data to show that there's a real purpose and that these kids are more financially stable when they get out and get jobs and, and become adults and citizens in our community. The program is called Investing in Students, Making Math Count. It was launched to complement and reinforce the shift in national core academic standards for math. The curriculum shift focuses on giving students more real-life, robust group math lessons in place of the traditional method of solving multiple redundant math problems. Your homework assignment is right here on the board. It's page 52, 1 through 75. It makes it more fun because it's like a competition and so it makes you want to try harder for it. Well before this I didn't really know much about the stock market or about percents and percent of increase so this kind of helped me to understand um, what adults do a lot with the stock market and how to find those percents. It's really helped get some kids excited about math who otherwise maybe don't do it as well in math and this has given them a chance to experience some success. Holly Mills' son and Tom Wood's daughter, Madison, participated in the math project. They were impressed to see their children take such an active interest in the math formulas they use each day as Fidelity employees. Yeah, it absolutely brings life together with school. And anytime I can do that with him, it's a positive thing. It, it did, uh, you know, uniquely because I work in the financial services industry. I, she did come home with questions about um, finance and the stock market, so it did give us a chance to talk on a level that, quite honestly, we haven't been able to. So it was, it was fun for me as well. And district leaders are hoping the positive things they learn through the Making Math Count project turns into positive life decisions in high school and beyond. I'll save more, probably and use it for better things than just little things. It teaches us, me and my partner, how to um, control our money and how to do it well so that we can end up with the most. It like shows you how to wait till like prices go down or how they're gonna change and then when you should buy things at lower prices before they go up. So far, those lessons seem to be getting through loud and clear.